early, man. Kev, it's early, bro. What is up, guys? Welcome to the vlog. We have a sunrise shoot today. Kev, who are we shooting today? Uh, the black Evo, and I guess there's, there's two Evos we're shooting today. We've got some really gnarly Evos. This is my first ever sunrise shoot. Well, at least for Legends Media, so I'm hoping it comes out pretty awesome. I know you guys are going to be excited because we do have a new location other than our regular beach spot, Kev. I have bad news for you, Dad. What's the bad news? I need to shit. <laughs> we can't. We can't. It's too late. I'll see you guys when we get to the spot. Uh. We made it, boys. We made it. It's all right on fucking time, Ooh. baby. Man, that thing is sick. We made it, and we're at this cool little parking structure. We have this pavilion right here where she can park under and shoot. It's gonna be really cool. Here's the Evo right here that we're shooting. Is it just him? No, we got another one. Okay. We got two Evos. Thing is so sick. Dang, I'm jealous. Oh, I need. So we still have one more Evo that we're waiting on, but I have this one staged where I want to do the first part of the video. I'm gonna let him do a full rundown of what's all done to the Evo. Basically it just has a arrow kit all done by me by hand. All of this stuff? That's yeah, crazy, that's dude. So you did that all yourself? Blocks, I made the dual canards with the end plates. We got the three-piece splitter with the little air dam in the middle. It has a Viz Racing front lip, Dulux style. It has carbon fiber vents. Carbon fiber hood, has the dual over fender arches, Voltex. Got the Voltex wing, uh, and my full rear diffuser. Voltex. Dude, this is sick. Did yeah, you make this yourself by, too? No, that's made by ASC Speed Metal down in uh, Chula Vista actually. This rear end is so sick. Like this wing is my dream wing. This is what I want to find for the Evo eventually. The other Evo is about to show up. I'm gonna go ahead and get all of my stuff set up right here. The gimbal with the A7S as well as my drone. You ready, Kev? Yeah, I pooped. <laughs> Ooh, I can I can sense him, Kev. I can sense the Evo. You hear? Do you oh. hear that? Do you hear that? It's the call of their family. <laughs> Damn. Crazy livery on and everything. Damn. Thing is sick. It smells like E85. Oh, it's so dope. Sun is rising really, really quickly. I'm gonna go ahead and put the drone up and then start getting all of our shots so it doesn't get too bright before we start shooting. Shooting with the new rig today, boys. I just picked up this A7R3, and we're trying out this Tamron. I heard very good things about this, and it's so much cheaper than a G Master 20 to 75 2.8. We'll see how it goes. This is where we're gonna have the cars parked up. How do you think the shoot's going, Kev? Pretty good. Sun's coming up, so. Some cops showed up, so we weren't actually able to put these cars under the pavilion just yet, or do any rollers. We're trying not to get kicked out of this place because it actually is a really cool location. So I'm getting some shots on the gimbal, and then we might try and find one other spot after this location because we are pretty limited up here. One thing I will say is I'm not a huge fan of shooting two cars at one time, so I'm stepping out of my comfort zone a little bit here and trying to, to make it work. I always prefer shooting one car at a time, but shooting two is a little bit more difficult, so I kind of like pushing myself to try new things. Well, 
the time has come. The sun peaked over the mountain over there, so it's super bright up here now. We're gonna go and check if they open up the gates to the downstairs lot, because there is a super cool location in the actual parking garage. I think we got some awesome shots up here, and now it's time for location number two. found this awesome little window spot right here with like a platform kind of thing. It's gonna be dope for shooting both of these cars at the same time. I'm gonna go ahead and set them up and then get some shots. It's either we go symmetric or we just go completely asymmetric. I think we just go for it because this little cylinder right here is not symmetrical, so. Yeah. We're going for it. It looks good, it looks good. So now that we're done with duels, we're doing single shots in this little pavilion area thing here. I think it'd be cool to kind of feature them together and then do like single shots to kind of switch in between doubles and singles. I'm just basically focusing on small details such as the Voltex canards, the wheels, the awesome little mirrors, and this super crazy Voltex wing. I want this so bad. Oh, you guys already know that I have the diffuser ready to go, but once we get my car all painted up, my car's gonna be insane, and I wanna do a shoot with all of these Eagle guys because these are the people that I look up to. Cars like this is just insane. Even the interior of this one, oh, the half cage and the rear seat delete, ultimate goal. I think that's a wrap. Are we good, guys? We're good? Thank you guys for coming out. That was an awesome time. This is gonna be dope. Two awesome Evos. Oh, good. good shoot. I think we got a lot done today. We got up super early, but it was definitely worth it, I think. The drone shots that I got and a lot of the stuff that we got on top of the garage was really cool, as well as this cool little spot. Definitely a good change of scenery, finally not shooting on the beach. We gotta find more spots, Kev. We do. That's just as lazy to scout. What? Scouting. You don't scout either. Yeah, I'm working. You're playing fucking Call of Duty. Maybe. You are hungry, and when you get hungry, you get angry. It's not. Spend it a little bit. Where's Tia? Tia? you watching this video, please, please confirm. <laughs> We're going to eat breakfast now. Kev, this looks like you're taking me to a vegan, a vegan restaurant here. Yeah, I fucking hope not. I'm a full on meat eater. I'm a carnivore. Oh, oh yeah. Bum, bum, bum. All right, Kev, I hope this is good, brother. Uh, Watch how many get that. I don't know what the fuck this, is. Dude, look at this fat burrito. It's a pretty massive burrito. I'd rate this burrito a solid, Seven and a half out of ten. That's a good, it's good. Kev did good picking it out. I was a little skeptical at first. You're not gonna buy this shirt? It's 35 bucks. I think this will fit you, Kev, actually. <laughs> nice, of a kind. nice crop top on you. So, crazy enough, the place that we just shot at actually has a pretty awesome cars and coffee going on here. So, me and Kev decided after we eat to come back and check out the cars and coffee. We're gonna go walk around and see what we can find. I'm not a huge supercar fan, but McLarens are definitely my choice of supercar. McLaren, that's actually really tight. Four GT. Oh, hey, the Lambo is easier. Remember, you missed. We we shot that. Remember oh yeah, one, we one did. Of, one of our first gigs. We were shooting. We shot that reveal. Yep, that was a good car. Found my family, Kev. I thought you were. I thought you were talking about your Evo. Bro. Oh, there's Evo Bros over there too. Oh, and, and an Arc Seven. It's a nice FD over there. Oh. We found the little JDM section over here. We got the Subarus. Then, oh, there's our friends. We just shot them. And then the RX-7. I'm gonna be honest here, that was kind of disappointing. <laughs> that was gonna be a lot better than what it was. You mean a lot bigger? Yes. Right. But, all right, I'll see you guys when we get home. 
Okay guys, that is going to be the end of the video. Make sure you watch the next video because that will be the full official edit of the two Evos. Huge thank you to those guys for coming out super early in the morning. I had an awesome time at my first ever real sunrise photo shoot, I guess. I think the outcome was really good. I'm excited to release the video on Friday. Be sure to stay tuned for that. I have a lot of awesome Evo updates coming out as well, so be sure to stay tuned to the channel. I'm going to be at SEMA this following week and I haven't really decided if I'm going to film or take the week off yet, so I'm still deciding on that. Stay up to the channel and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.